this is Kosovo guys and there are very few people living in this area this area sits on a very large acre of land it stretches across there to, to, to Narok to my Mahio guys it's, it's part of the Nakuru County guys here in Africa and I think this area is forgotten I'm just gonna take you to, to this road and show you this area join me guys you can see this area this is a road it stretched all the way to, to, to the main um, South Lake Road these are shops and then this is the other road the cactus uh, you can notice this area is dry the population around here is quite low but um let's let's go let's... i've never been to this place i've just heard about it i was just told by my friend but i'm just gonna show you guys how it basically looks like there are a lot of uh the bandas here these are kiosks these are kiosks so these are where people basically live here yes yeah, so this it works around that area yeah, so this is another fencing around this here you can you have noticed the the iron sheets the gate this is someone's property around how this place looks looks like so um this is a school uh ecd school ecd center this is just an empty land here yeah that, that is an empty land there you can see right now it's around like 3 p.m here in east africa yeah so i'm gonna take you a tour around this place i've uh, exited from the main road and now i'm on another road yeah you can see there's a friend there this is my friend there you can see the, the area the area is quite peaceful the area is not quite peaceful the area is peaceful you can notice from the fencing the structure just simply everything yeah this this is the this is the area guys this is called kosovo or uh, it is it is uh, around like kedong ranch the main kedong you hear uh, it's a maasai name yeah this i think this is a church if i'm not wrong or maybe someone's homestead empty land empty land you know yeah so there's a lot of uh, construction going around this area if you have noticed from the stones like uh, on the sides of the roads like here you can see the sand uh, covered in a road here probably uh, and there's a construction and uh, we are waiting to, to go to carry on yeah you can see the place i'm gonna take you to this area you can see the fencing the fencing is from the just the sticks which they, they came from forest yeah, so this kind of fencing it's not that bad you know uh, because there is just an empty land a bare land around that area yeah where there is other this fencing here there's another fencing that's there's someone plot there's a gate there yeah so guys i'm gonna go this down Yeah, so uh, probably you haven't been used, been used to, to such kind of areas there are properties coming up and now they are apart from each other so you can notice this area and see some fundis there i'm gonna give you a short tour around this area yeah so um development coming up means uh, that uh, the area is growing around you can see when they put this no one can mess around i'm gonna enter to another road if i find some road there and yeah, this uh, this is someone's homestead this is someone's homestead i can't interfere because there are animal security like dogs and stuff like that you can see this fencing i've told you it's quite popular around this area you can see yeah that fencing is quite popular so i'm gonna here there's a road there's another road here around here so i'm gonna just explore and see where this road takes me so i'm just going here i'm just heading this way yeah 
I've seen few dogs around this area. Uh, on an empty land like this, we'll uh, mainly see like dogs like trying to search. Come on, puppy. She's shy. She, yeah, uh, she, she, she's shy. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. She's probably shy. is following me so here's another doggy <laughs> basically she's she's shy they are both they are all shy yeah. so this this is a uh, bare land there's no way you can see so many stones uh, on, on this area so that means that uh, it is quite developing you can't judge from um, negatively about this area plus the people are friendly I haven't experienced like any altercation around this area you know yeah you can see the, you can start to see the buildings you can start to see the buildings around this area so I want to give you a, a, a tour of, of, of this area so let me just head this way and then I'll branch to, to the right and then now take you to a whole different place which now I haven't uh, not I haven't uh, gone to so you can see the fencing of this area these are the fencing of this area these are just kids playing you know let me take you to this place and you see for yourself so you, you can see that there are a lot of stones around here a lot of them give this place is not like unsafe no, it's not unsafe because I've asked. Here's a here's a road. Um, I've asked uh, about this area, and probably at this time, uh, it's it's quite safe. It's, I can say it's safe for, for for me shooting video. But around like 6 p.m. to to to, to go onwards uh, to in the night, the area is not quite quite safe for, for anyone to walk. You know just risky there are a lot of shops small small shops here yeah and now we are on another road this is another road i'm just following this road so uh, just kind of see for ourselves here see what it has for us you know yeah so this this road is like quite enough for 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 a PSV for a, a small vehicle, but not like a, a lorry or something. I'm just gonna use another road here, and uh, my beard is growing. I don't know. It's kind of itchy. It's kind of itchy. So this place has so uh, doesn't have so many houses. You can see the houses are very minimal yeah so i'm just wondering this i think this area is just forgotten or people don't want to settle in this area the reasons i don't know why these are shops and i'm passing around here yeah, look look at this route i can't use that route can't use that route because I don't know where it's heading. But I'm gonna. I think let me use this route. So yeah, in places like this, we'll find like um, things are quite cheap. Things are quite cheap around here. You can see because the area doesn't have a lot of people. There's a lot of people work uh, in flower farms. So basically, let, let, let us see if uh, we're gonna go and exit from that road. Yeah, they're on holiday right now. So these are homes. The Kayafa. They're quite 
quite popular around this area so you'll see them often okay, so this is the road that we have we came from and i'm gonna just use the same road because i've noticed um that area i really don't know about that area so i'm just gonna return from where i came from and see yeah, you can see the shops here kids are playing there everything So that's it guys. I wanna take you to these places man like I wanna get deep deep into the hood now. Uh I've been told this area is is that dangerous so uh, I'm not gonna use that area. I ain't gonna use that road. I'm gonna use another road. So we have come we remember we came from this road i don't know if you can spot the lake from afar yeah that's the lake this whole stretch this white thing this white thing you're seeing here that's the lake here yeah and this whole 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 acre it stretches uh, kilometers and acres and hectares there and this is kedong ranch it's a whole big ranch you see all these electric poles like on this road that is that that is Kedong ranch guys that is Kedong ranch yes and these are, are, are people's properties you know these are people's properties you're gonna see now here you can get a good view of this uh, whole estate where people are purchasing land to, to, to build I don't know if you can see, you can spot now the, the whole area. You can see. You can spot that whole area. People are, people are buying land here. Kedong. Yeah. It's probably a good place to buy land. Uh, because um, it's not that, that lucky. It's quite cheap. But uh, people really haven't like uh, known there's a gem around here. You know, living like from Naivasha town, uh, and it's around like uh, five kilometers. And from uh, Nairobi now, Naivasha to Nairobi now, the, the city of Kenya, the capital city of Kenya now, it's around like um, it's two hours drive, one hour thirty minutes drive, two hours drive. It depends. So this very, uh, place is very good. Plus the lakeside. So you know, yeah, like like right now, as I, as I'm talking to you guys, um, the, the, the weather the weather is cool, like uh, this breeze because of the lake, the lake, uh, yeah, yeah. So this place is good, good for for for, for settling. Maybe you wanna build maybe a, an Airbnb around here. Yes, these are the fruits I was telling you. I don't know what you call them uh, I think uh, I kind of saw they are also found in Ethiopia they're mostly found on, on the on the desert areas yeah, but this uh, I'm gonna not eat this because I see this they are purple and I'm not, uh, I'm, not I'm not just going to put anything I see I see like I'm um, eatable anything like I think it's palatable and put it in my mouth yes I'm not gonna do that see the area you can see the area for yourself so um i i, I told my friend one of my friends to take me to, to, to this area because he knew well this area because he has come and he work in the construction area and probably he has come to this area often because he he, he the, you can see there, there there are many properties ongoing uh many constructions ongoing so I, I told him to take me to this place but he said it was too dangerous yeah, maybe probably it's the time maybe the time you know like maybe in the morning or or late in the evening like when the, there is dark you know when there's a lot of dark a, a lot of things happen there's a lot of things happening when the, when the when the when the sun set 
yeah so he didn't take me around this area he didn't want me to take me so that's why i've avoided that area i was going to that direction but uh, i've just asked and uh i was told no 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 not to record with my camera i can go but not with my camera yeah plus you know like now what was the point of walking without now recording yeah i have to explore guys with you i'll see i'll see you guys uh, um i want you guys to get i want to, to give you a tour of this place it's like from wherever you are in in, in the world like now in, when when somebody mentions naivasha or, or kenya you can tell him you know like i know i know naivasha i know kedong i've taken you to the hills i've taken you uh, different places to the hell's gate you know guys yeah so i thought that that was a hotel that 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 hut there you can see a hut there yeah so that that was a hotel so i'm gonna go i'm going through this area this is a path so in areas like this you may find snakes you know because now you can see the sun they are basking in the sun you are, uh, you are likely to find snakes around this area yeah but we just go <laughs> i'm not prepared for anything but we have to prepare for anything you know prepare for the worst hope hope for the best now this is sanctuary probably you are, you are maybe heard of this place uh, it's called sanctuary this is a road don't know if you follow this road this road connects to the road that we came from i don't want to go to that area now i want to head down to, to to the streets to this streets let me take you now to the streets now guys let us go yeah tell me tell me how you think about this video tell me how you think about this place does it look familiar to you you know maybe it may look familiar to you guys it may look familiar to you so let's go yeah i want to, go, to head on this road i don't know how this road where it's heading yeah so, so these are the fencing guys these are the fencing so it tells you basically um insecurities around this here are, are minimal are minimal you know like not every place is safe here yeah, but 100 percent safe yeah so this is uh the view of lake naivasha guys uh if you can see from from the side you can see the white thing the white thing uh, stretching all the way uh, that's like naivasha here there's a good view maybe because uh, my camera quality it uh, isn't that good but um until next time guys hasta la vista thank you so much guys for watching